hey, business math team, I just sent out your test one in an attachment to an email. And this video is a hint about how you should download the file, complete it, and upload it. So here's the email down at the bottom. Here's the link. I'm going to click. It opens the Save As dialog box. You should navigate on the left to the correct folder or wherever you want to save it. And the most important thing is this file name right here. You got to change where it says your name. You have to put your name. So if your name is Michael Gervin, oh, that's my name. I'm going to put Michael Gervin. The second important thing is do not change the file extension. It has to say .xlsm. So when you download it, you should have your name, business135, test01.xlsm. Now on some computers, the default settings might not show the .xlsm, but then you have to read down here. What's the file type? It's got to say Microsoft Excel Macro Enabled Worksheet. Once you got all that correct, you click Save. Now you can go to whatever location you saved it to. I'm using Windows Explorer, clicking on the jump drive, clicking on my Business 135, and sure enough, there it is. I'm going to double click and open this. Now you're going to get six sheets, problems one, two, three, four. At the top of each sheet will be the yellow instructions, and then down below you complete. And there'll be a number of problems. Now, when you do your word problems, boom, they're going to ask you a question, and you have to do step one, step two, step three, exactly like I taught you in the videos. So when you're done, you work on each sheet. You save it, and I would save it as I work along, close it. All right, so now you have a finished file. Get it? This is not a true false multiple choice test. This is an Excel math test. You have to do your math in Excel using efficient features. So now I have my uh, test all finished. I'm going to go over to Canvas. All right, and just as in week one, you did quiz one, the quiz was right in the week one section on the home section. Here's week two, and there's the link for the upload. Do not click this until you're finished with that test and you've named it correctly and it has the correct file extension .xlsm. Hey, I'm going to click this. It's going to open. Notice right here it even says file type. It won't let you even upload unless you have the right file type. I'm going to come over here and click Submit Assignment, Choose File, Navigate, and there it is. I'm going to double click it. It's uploading. I'm going to be sure and put a comment and then sign your name. And there you're going to click Submit Assignment. You are uploading a file to Canvas so that I can then later download it and grade it. Now, now you can see submission turned in over there at the right time. Now there's a due date and time. That's in the instructions in your email. Be sure that you upload it before that. Hey, OK, later after I grade them, you can come back to this section and there will be a comment and a second file with your score, a detailed score sheet. All right, uh, I hope that's helpful. We'll see you next video.